Fortnite Chapter 2 Remix has been completely revealed over the past few days, coming from new map leaks to the entire Battle Pass getting leaked by Fortnite themselves, and even news about the live event for the end of this season in the most recent updates. You guys do not want to go anywhere, let's get straight into everything. And remember guys, I am gifting 5 lucky subscribers every single day. For the people who do, drop a like on the video, subscribe with all notifications turned on, and drop a comment with your epic ID name in the comment section below. Let me know if you want any Marvel skins coming into the item shop, or the brand new Battle Pass, which the Battle Pass is really really good this season before we go any further if you guys don't like the video in the next five seconds this will happen when you next log into fortnite but if you do like the video this will be on your account waiting for you the choice is all yours so quickly before we go into anything the last two halloween skins are now in the item shop we got the symbiotes the she venom and agony and also leather face so if you guys are picking any of these skins up please do consider popping in my support credit code apple one as it does help out the channel an absolute ton and it's a really really small code to put in so starting off with the new update as we know we had an update on Thursday, which, well, it added quite literally nothing. <laughs> Everything is encrypted apart from one little thing. The live event countdown will now be purple when it's activated in the lobby and will display a logo for the first time ever, which is also encrypted. So we don't even know what the logo is. But my guess is the logo will probably be the Chapter 2 Remix logo. And that whole season has literally just been fully revealed. Fortnite last night revealed three teaser videos and each one of them, they showed the Chapter 2 in reverse with parts of the video glitching and showing us the new season's battle pass and map anyway we have a total of five skins next season and it will only be a month long and the battle pass will cost the same amount 950 v bucks which does suck because we're essentially only getting half of the rewards but in the first video fortnite teased at the very start you guys can see our very first battle pass skin being a tnt tina mixed with ocean and this skin looks absolutely amazing it actually does look really really cool as well as a brand new 8-ball skin being called One Ball, and he's actually going to be golden and black, which the 8 on his face has actually now changed to a 1. You guys can get a better look at these skins at the very end of this video, which you guys can see, these are going to be the first two skins you unlock inside of the Battle Pass, and I actually can't wait to get these. They look really, really sick. The second video they posted showed the other three skins releasing next season. Starting with a brand new female Chaos Agent skin, which I think this skin looks really cool. I know a lot of sweats are going to be using her, including myself. I think it's really, really sick. And we then have the last two skins. The first one on the left being the female Guff skin, which looks to be remixed with Sky and then Midas Meow Scores, which everyone knew he was getting. And here's a better look of what the skin actually does look like. And this actually does tease we're also going to be getting golden skins next season as well, just like we had in Chapter 1 OG. This is going to be a really, really sick battle pass and will be the very last skin you unlock next season. We still have one more video to show you guys though. And in this, I actually did show a remix version of the battle pass room, which was introduced in Chapter chapter 2 and this actually may mean it will be returning next season and maybe even for chapter 6 which I think would be so so cool bro but in the second video the female of guff skin is actually currently on a skin survey so I did some thinking and some digging around started looking through the surveys and I actually found a lot of remix skins in here that will most likely be inside of the item shop next season starting with this crack shot fish stick skin I know this skin's been in the surveys for a long time because I've wanted the skin to come out for a very very long time we then have this mechanical tomato head which also bundles up with a mechanical metal fish stick skin it's actually a pretty cool skin i can't lie let me know your thoughts in the comment section about, about both of these we then have the gingerbread assault trooper which i actually think looks really cool even though it's a chapter one remix skin it may still release inside of the chapter two remix we're just gonna have to wait and see but moving on we actually have a brand new teaser for snoop dogg to be releasing very soon as well most likely going to be coming out next season even though in the roadmap he was supposed to come out this season but you guys can see here the item shop background and a new video he accidentally posted being his lego character which i'm actually super excited for this skin to release it's inside of warzone and now it's coming to fortnite next season i am so so excited we also have a possible Ripley remix skin with the first badge that we shown off, but we're not too sure on that one. So it could be Ripley April skin, which would be pretty insane, but we're going to have to wait and see. We then have a confirmed POI remix for next season being Misty Meadows with this pin in the top right. It will be returning next season with a possible change, which is my personal favorite POI in the whole of chapter two. I love landing here. But next to that, we have a new butterfly pin, which is actually going to be possibly teasing the live event as we are due to be going back into 
into a black hole at the end of next season, which is actually going to be taking us into chapter six, which is going to be pretty sick. The live event won't be the same as the very first Doomsday event. It's going to be a remix version of the Doomsday event or something completely different. We're not 100% sure what live event we're going to be getting. It might be just a completely brand new one. And the main villain for this Fortnite Mads is obviously Mephisto. And this is where the new live event for this season will take place. We all thought at the start of the season, Doctor Doom would team up with Mephisto to revive Galactus. But it turns out they are the completely opposite sides of the map for a reason. As Mephisto's new Styx River actually leads towards Galactus and Galactus isn't even dead. In the comics, he was revived by a star crystal after the Devour event and he's just currently in another reality, just chilling. And Mephisto can't control Galactus as he doesn't have a soul. The same with Doombot, which is why Doctor Doom isn't on the island summoning Mephisto because Mephisto would be able to control him. Instead, Mephisto is going to team up with Galactus to destroy Doombot, luring Doctor Doom back into this reality after we teleported him away with the Rift Beacon in the previous live event we had this season. Yeah, it's getting a bit complicated, but stay with me. And Doctor Doom will actually have a huge battle against Galactus, eventually ending up disrupting the Zero Point again and heading us into another black hole for Chapter 2 OG leaked by Hypex. We will be getting a brand new black hole, Galactus will be reviving, Doctor Doom will be returning, and Mephisto will be the reason for it all. It's going to be a really, really cool live event this season. You guys don't really want to miss out on this. So be on the lookout for the live event countdown appearing near Mephisto's POI as it's now been leaked by Sheena in the lobby as well. And I can't lie, this live event sounds to be very, very big. A leaker has also been sent to this image by an anonymous source of the time machine appearing on the Fortnite reload map, which doesn't make any sense whatsoever. But this actually could be tied in with the live event because usually on Twitter, fake leaks get a community note and this tweet does not have one, confirming it is a real leak. And we're just going to have to wait and see what it does mean. But in yesterday's update, they actually added a brand new survey with a load of skins, which is actually teasing the chapter six theme already, bro. We haven't even gone into the last season of chapter five yet and they're already teasing chapter six which you guys can see is actually going to be a superhero theme as most of these skins in this survey have this exact same logo on them so this is going to be a really really cool theme for chapter six i am so excited for a superhero season bro it's going to be nuts but we also have a bunch of leaks about chapter six recently fauna added a bunch of first person mechanics into the game with the current loot pool and with them now adding the chapter six in the testing servers this chapter will officially release on December the 1st. So Chapter 2 OG will be playable for one month and it's going to be pretty insane, but it looks like we're actually going to be getting first person inside of Chapter 6 finally, bro. We've been waiting for it for around two chapters now. I can't lie. It's been a very, very long time, but it looks like it's finally releasing. We also have a new PlayStation Black Friday pack coming to Fortnite, releasing on October the 11th, which includes eight exclusive Fortnite cosmetics worth 5,000 V-Bucks value, which is most likely going to be the Cobalt Snowfoot bundle which you guys can see here the skin is actually really cool with his matching bat bling pickaxe wrap and other stuff this is most likely going to be that pack because we do know this is going to be a free pack coming to the game and it makes a lot of sense for it to be a playstation pack so make sure you guys are on the lookout for this skin as well releasing next month which honestly next month's going to be insane bro we've got chapter 2 og a load of brand new free bundles that are getting leaked already i'm very excited